Hey YouTube, it's me Christian the Pilot and welcome to my channel, welcome to my new video. This is as always take number 8. Did I say 8? No, I actually meant take number 27. This is no joke guys, this is actually honestly take number 27. In this video I'm going to do something different, it's not going to be about planes or flying, no. It's going to be an unboxing and setup and test of this, yes you guessed it, it's a robotic lawnmower. I wanted to get one for a long time. I finally did it. This one is from Works Landroid WR141E. This is how the box looks like. Works Landroid Landroid Roid Roid Rage Landroid Rage Works Landroid Rage WR141E. Uh, there's maybe somebody out there who is thinking about getting this, uh, maybe getting a different model. If so, then this video is for you. I hope it finds you in good health. And before I start, as always guys, I don't plug. Nobody's paying me for, for doing this, though I wish somebody would, but that's not the case. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you think. Uh, share your experiences with me if you have this model. Hit the like or dislike button. Subscribe, you know the drill. Thank you so much for watching and uh, let's open it. Let's get to it. A look at the box. I haven't opened it yet. I just got this today. There is a little bit of damage right there and um, right here. The box is pretty heavy. Um, I'm not too worried about it. Um, there's also a little bit of damage here. You know, for the weight uh, of the box, um, this is probably normal. So let's get a knife. Let's open. All right. like a ruler right there all right what do we have user manuals more user manuals get started user manual I think I'm going to go to college for four years before I know how to set this up. You know, the packaging, it is quite stable, honestly. I mean, it's, it's nicely packaged, you know, in separate compartments. But, of course, this is something that I would expect. This model is pretty expensive. Um, this one costs about 650 euros, which is what, maybe 650 bucks? It's more like 700 bucks. And that's a lot of money, at least for me. So, um, you know, a good packaging is something that I would expect for this kind of cash. So let's see, let's see what do we have. Let's open this. This seems to be the power cable that is attached to just cardboard. Can't pull it out. Let's start with something else. All right, these are the ground pegs. The ground pegs for the, what would you call this, a boundary wire maybe? Is that what you would call it, call it? boundary wire? Oh my gosh. All right, this is the boundary wire, the boundary wire. This is um, 130 meters. I looked at my yard and I think that I need um, maybe something like 110. So this should be plenty. And these are the ground pegs that you use to hammer the wire in the ground. 
All right, so what else do we have? This is uh, the power cable, which probably attaches to this, to this one. All right. Let's let's see how this looks like. This is interesting. There is more, I don't know what this is, more user manuals, I don't know, maybe it's the warranty. I'm not going to read it right now, um, but this is, this is the more guys, this is it. Um, let me pull it out of the box um, and maybe I can get a better shot of this so you can take a look at it. Alright, so here are the contents of the box. You get a charging station right there. This is how it looks like. You get a battery with it. It's an uh, iron lithium battery. Works. You get the mower. You know, it's kind of neat how it looks like. I like the design. I like the looks of it. It looks kind of slick, I think. So. Let me know what you think about it. And you'll get a bunch of manuals. You get the ground pegs and you get the boundary wire. So let's go outside, look at my yard and uh, let's see if uh, we can set it up. It's probably going to take a whole day to set it up. My plan is to actually bury the uh, boundary wire because I want to detach my lawn at least once a year and if the wire sits on top of the lawn I'm afraid that I might damage it so let's see if I will be able to somehow bury it and get it all set up all right Alright, so this is the yard that we're going to work with. It's not very big, it's about maybe 200 square meters, which is what, 2100 square feet, I think. Uh, the robot is designed to handle yards up to 500 square meters, which would be maybe, I don't know, 5400 square foot, uh, I think, somewhere around there. Um, the yard is not very complicated, but it has a few tight spots and uh, some obstacles, you know, I have a tree, a, a slide for the kids and all that stuff. So um, let's see how it performs. Let's get to work. <laughs> 